What is going on, everybody? It is Army Mess here, and welcome back to more Paper Mario 64. Um, picking up where we left off, we came to the room where we're going to fight Ten Koopa, so without further ado, here we go. <laughs> Ooh, what's happening? What is that flying hat doing? Is he a ghost? Or is he made out of Lego pieces? You! You ignored all those very scary warnings! Don't you have the common sense to get scared and run away? What's wrong with you? You shouldn't mess with Tutankoopa, Koopa, a faithful follower of King Bowser. Oops, I mean, you shall regret this. Well, just to see about that. Um, <clears throat> so before this uh, fight, my apologies guys, I was way too uh, confident and came totally unprepared, so I had to hike all the way back to Dry Dry Outpost and get and arm myself with items. So now it'll be much easier to fight him. So I'm going to start with Power Jump. That's a very good move. And I leveled up my HP. The next time I think I'll level up my badge points. Bleh heh 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 heh. I think I should use the voice like, Come, chomp, come, bite this intruder. Yeah, that sounds more epic. Oh no, it's his guard dog. Stand your ground, Mario. I mean, stand your ground, Mario. Keep the calm, even if he's a vicious a dog. Um, I recommend not attacking the chain chomp too much, just mainly him. Tutton Koopa. Yeah, I got him good. At first I thought my aim was not so good, but it actually was. Still good. Whoa. It's very hard to guard that. Blah heh 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 heh. I'm a magical genius. Watch and be amazed. Oh, ah, that was a surprise attack. Ah, Paracure is temporarily injured. I'm gonna um, fight him solo for a bit. How could you hurt my friend? I really hate when he does that, just waits and then, yeah, surprise attack. That's when it's really hard to guard him. Hmm. I think I'll use a mushroom first. Guard down this time. Oh man. Oh, whew, I got lucky and enough for it to backfire on him. Now it makes you think, did I get him? Oh no, you're not out of the, the, the woods just yet. You still have to fight me even when I'm busy. It's kind of like that. I think I'll do a refresh so it, um, Replenishes both HP and FP. Yeah, and I got him. You got twenty-five star points. No. Ah, come here, Chompy. Why? What are you? Ow! Help! You dare disobey your owner and bite me? Everything has backfired on you. <laughs> At this point. And with that, I bid you good day, my good sir. I wonder what we got now. 
da 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 End of chapter. Thus Mario and party unearth the legendary Dry Dry Runes deep within Dry Dry Desert. They smashed Tut and Koopa the Wizard and freed Mamar, the second of the wish-granting Star Spirits. But the enemies awaiting Mario grow ever stronger, and the challenges more difficult. What's in store for Mario and friends? Where will their adventure take them next? Save and continue, yes. We are going to do another Peach Interlude. Ha 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 ha. Hello. How are you feeling, princess? Nothing makes me happier than a smile from you, Peach. I'm not smiling. <laughs> well, tough luck. I'm in a very bad mood, you monster. You've imprisoned all of the guests from the castle. You are the single greatest disaster to ever befall the Mushroom Kingdom. I'll tell you what. I'll smile when you make everything as it was before you showed up. Go ha ha. Oh, that's rich. You know I can't do that. That jerk Mario just beat the Koopa Bros and Tug Koopa. Sure, they were complete wimps, but they were still loyal to me. I can't forgive Mario for disrespecting me. I'm nipping this in the bud right now. I'm going to use Invincible Tubba Blubba on him. He's the strongest creature I know. After me. You best forget about Mario. You're in nastiness. We have a problem. War, Kama Koopa. What's got you so riled up? You look upset. What? The star spirit flew away from Tubble Blubbo's castle? K King Bowser, keep your voice down. Princess Peach will hear you. Hmm, yes, right. Tell me the details over there. <laughs> Princess Peach will hear you, more like the female version of Sherlock Holmes the detective. What was that I hear? No, nothing Peach Lock. <laughs> Twink, did you hear that? Yes, I sure did. The star spirit must have escaped. Did you hear him call that tub of blubber thing invincible? That doesn't sound good. Do you think Mario can win? We better try to find out about tub of blubber. If we could find something, anything, about a weak point, it might just save Mario. Good idea. Then, there's no time to lose. We won't get anything done if we stay in this room. <laughs> Secret button again. Doo -doo -doo. I got a feeling this is the one where we go outside this time. Let's find out. There are still guards outside. Be careful not to get caught. Now, is this the one where we go into the library? I think it is. Let's see. There are guards here too. Probably lots of them. We better be extra careful. Ba 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 da 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 And now, you got the Power Rush badge. When Mario's in danger, his attack card. Ooh, I'm definitely gonna put this in. Uh, I'm definitely gonna put this in the chest later, just in case, because it would definitely come in handy if he's in peril on his final fight with Bowser. Hey, have you heard about Master Tubba Blubba? I heard a rumor that he loves eating ghosts. Ugh, ghosts, huh? Master Tubba Blubba, he lives deep inside a forever forest, doesn't he? I think he's guarding one of the star spirits right now. Yeah, Master Tubba Blubba lives in the castle at the top of Gusty Gulch. I heard that somewhere near his castle is a mansion in a village full of ghosts. I guess Master Tubba Blubba sometimes goes there to catch booze. And then, when he catches one, he gobbles it down starting, uh, it, it down starting with its head. Chomp! Brrr! Oh man, that's so scary. Now I won't be able to walk to the bathroom alone at night, and I'm gonna have nightmares, I know it. Why'd you tell me? 
I also heard that Master Tub of Love is invincible. They say he can't be hurt. Nobody can even scratch him. I imagine these guys camping together and they uh, tell spooky campfire stories like that. That would for sure give them uh, nightmares and wet the bed in their tent. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. He might even be stronger than King Bowser. Stronger than King Bowser? Come on, that's impossible. Even Master Tub of Love has to have some weak points. It's just common sense. Yeah, you may be right. There's another rumor that Tub of Love has got a secret that would ruin him if it ever got out. I bet it's about his past. I heard he didn't used to be strong at all. Shh. What if Tub of Love hears you? He might gobble us up. Still, what do you think his secret could be anyway? I don't know. No one knows. That's why it's a secret, you half-wit. Twink. It sounds like Tub of Love has a weak point after all. If only we could find out. <gasps> hey, did you hear someone talking just now? <gasps> Do you think someone knows we're goofing off in here? Yeah, the park rangers. <laughs> they know you're telling spooky stories by the campfire. Oh, whoa, Princess Peach, how'd you get here? I'm sorry to do this, but you have to go back to your room right now. No. Oh, no. Even Twink looks terrified. <clears throat> Thank you, Mario. At last I can head home to Star Haven. My name is Mamar. So nice to meet you in person. You've still got a long way to go, but I just know you can save Princess Peach. I'll do my best to help you. Here's a present for you. Ha 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 ha. No, wait, wait. I should say that for when he goes, when, for when she goes to Star Haven. Mario's star energy goes up to two. Mario can now use Lullaby, a new star spirit power. With Lullaby, you can make all enemies fall asleep. Call on me when times are bad. Believe in this, Mario. My powers are strong. I'm a star spirit after all. <laughs> Our powers are growing all the time. Keep up the good work, Mario. You must save the other star spirits as soon as possible. For now, I'm going back to recover in Star Haven. Who knows how my dear old Star Haven is faring without the star rod. Goodbye, Mario. I'm off. Uh, uh, uh. See, that would be um, more appropriate because be uh, uh, um, to see him because Star Haven is like heaven, and if she's soaring up there, I think, hey, that would be a good time to say it. Kind of makes sense that I. Um, um, it, um, it kind of makes sense that I did it while Mara was glowing, too, because I got a piece of her heaven. Okay, so watch out for these shy guys. Those little walking rats. Trying to steal my coins. And speaking of camping, the game read my mind. <laughs> Professor Colorado is telling spooky campfire stories as well. The ghost came, uh, um, Kimbu came and kidnapped uh, you and his painting, Mar Mario boy, and Luigi came to rescue you. <sighs> Makes me a shove dirty thinking about it. Now I'm going to wet the bed at the night. Thanks a lot, Colorado. A day in it. It's a me, Danio. Danio. <clears throat> no, I don't I do not even need to cross the gap. I can just jump up there. Boing. Whoa, walking boulders coming my way. Don't do it. Oh, I don't think I got that bubble guy yet, did I? I'm going to go back. Because that's absolutely... Ah! Tripped. That's absolutely necessary for, um, chapter 6 later. Yes, I knew I totally missed him. So I have to go come back for him. Huh? You're talking to me? I don't see anyone else here. Alright, you are talking to me. It's been a long while since I first came here from my home in Flower Fields. But you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. 
Nobody ever notices me. The few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. I love a good conversation. Here, take this as thanks. This is a precious seed. Keep it well and remember me. You got the magical seed. Please grow my seed with care. It'll help you one day. Oh, I will. Th thank you. Okay, now we can proceed back to the train. Oh, there's a badge up there. Might be a good idea to check that out and grab it. I may not use it throughout the game, but still, it's a good idea to grab some badges while you're at it. And being in the chapter, you got the Koi Camera badge. Whoa. Whew, I'm surprised he didn't dare check the rock at me. Thank goodness. <clears throat> Boom. Goes the silver face. With this you can upgrade. Um, let's see if I can... No. I'm gonna wait until... I get another partner, which will actually be useful to me later in the game. Because I don't think I'll use all, all those um, powers down the road. Can I come in more? Yes. All aboard for Toe Town! I think the Excess, Excess Express is my favorite train that's, uh, in the Paper Mario series because you actually go in the sleeper car and spend three uh, days in that chapter, which is really cool. Town Town! Town Town! Thank you, Mario, but your princess is in another town. She a what? I thought she was about with the Bowser. Alright guys, let's get things off this episode next time on Paper Mario 64, we're gonna get started on chapter three. Until then, I'll remaster out. Peace.